But I don't know if he's ever had this type of an introduction. I'm going to give you one of these weird sort of a thing uh, that happened in life, kind of a twist story. Earlier today, I was proctoring uh, an AP exam at the high school where I do a lot of work. And when you're proctoring, it, you know, it's a little long in the time, you know, it's, it draws. And uh, so every once in a while, I'll do a crossword puzzle. So I had finished one crossword puzzle, and I was starting a new one. Honest to God, this truly happened to me this morning. I turn the page, and I'm, you know, working it out, and I get to 11 down, and it says, footballer, swan. <laughs> that is... Definitely uh, a true story. Can you imagine that surprise when I read that? And then I go, I couldn't make that up. I could not make that up, right? That is definitely true. The uh, oddly enough, the next clue was future wife. So I immediately wrote Collier in there, but the letters didn't quite fit. So I was like, oh. <laughs> I, uh, if my knees were not so bad, maybe we'd be talking about, you know, the future. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure and pride to bring up our athletic director, the answer to 11 down, Lynn Swan, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> 11 down. <laughs> Why couldn't it be 88 across? <laughs> No. Yeah, that's how you get hurt. <laughs> Good evening. How's everyone doing? Doing great. I want to thank all of you for being here. Um, the most important thing is to thank all the parents who are here. Um, all the friends, all the parents, uh, brothers and sisters of, of the athletes who are here. Thank you. Especially for the seniors uh, tonight. Thank you for entrusting your kids to this program. Uh, thank you for allowing them to participate, to grow, and build and matriculate through the University of Southern California. Um, you're going to hear a lot more tonight from the athletes themselves, uh, but we are truly grateful that you trusted uh, to our care, uh, your daughters, in this program. So thank you so very much for allowing us the privilege of coaching the history of the program. This is graduation week, so we have to thank uh, Student Athletes Academic Services, without which some of your kids may not have graduated. <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. Uh, these girls have done extraordinarily well in school. Um, I usually tell a story when I'm out playing golf, and because I'm not a very good golfer. And all golfers lie about their handicap, okay? Good golfers, who should be like a two or three, they say they're a six or a seven because they want more strokes. Bad golfers, who should be like 15, 16, 18, they don't want to be embarrassed, so they say they're a nine or a ten. I own it. I'm not that good. Okay? But I always tell them, I get to a golf course, I play bad, I go home, you know, I'm not feeling good about myself. I'm not feeling great about my athletic skills. So I go home, I take a shower, I get dressed. I put on my four Super Bowl rings <laughs> and my Hall of Fame ring, and I remind myself that I'm an athlete. Okay? I tell you that story because there are ladies in this room who have a career at USC in beach volleyball who can put their national championship rings on way down the road. Remember that you're a part of a great team and accomplish great things on the athletic turf. Okay? This has been a wonderful season for the volleyball team. I know sometimes your parents and the athletes are thinking, well, we came up one short. But think about your growth. Think about the challenge you faced this year. Think about how you dealt with it, the confidence you gained throughout the year, to play your best volleyball when it counted, and to move down that stretch. These are things that you will take with you for the rest of your life. When there's adversity in front of you, when things get a little bit of tough, get a little bit tough, you can think about this time period and how you fought through it all the way and never gave up. That's the most important thing you can take away with you, playing on the team. Those are things that you can build on for the rest of your life. Those are things that people can never take away from you in terms of your strength, your confidence, and your growth. So appreciate all that you've done and a great job on this team. Uh, they've been remarkable. 
Uh, it's a pleasure for me to be the athletic director here and be a part of your journey over the last four years. So thank you very much. Have a great night.